Well, Chester, it feels like we've been walking for ages, buddy. Well, I've been carrying you most of this time. That's a bunch of crap. I should have made you walk with me. I don't know why I'm doing that. Whatever. We're, we're almost to a stopping point anyway. There's no point in setting you down now, I guess, huh? So let's keep moving, pal. This was a long trip. I'm not going to lie, man. I am winded. But I, I, I swear I've never seen so many, so many different creatures before on my adventure. It's like... It's almost like, I, I don't know, I can't explain it. We're in, we're in a whole new place, almost. It's it's ridiculous. Uh, I seem to have come across a house, buddy. Um, maybe we should take a look around and see if anybody's inhabiting this place. Uh, let's go in here, I guess. Hello? Okay, so it doesn't look like anybody's home. Is so anybody up here? No, oh, but there looks to be some things left behind. Okay. Okay, I can get behind this. I like this. This is cool. Okay, so what What? What else? We have a, a cra two crafting tables and two furnaces. I mean, it, it looks abandoned. Uh, let's go around back and make sure nobody nobody's really out here. Yeah, yeah, this looks okay. I mean, oh, wow, look at all the birds. That is so cool. Anyway, yeah, I mean, this is a nice place as any. I mean, we have a nice pond in our backyard. I mean, it's it's already built for us, which is nice. I don't know when there's... I have some plans for, for things I would like to establish, like maybe build an underground la laboratory. I don't know. Because I don't really want to be sticking out of the ground, like outside, because I, I don't, I'm kind of scared. But I'm also afraid of small places ever since that jail cell. Hmm. Well, yeah, I think we're going to post up here for, for the next uh, foreseeable future, pal. So why don't we go ahead and, and first off, start by placing down my bed, and then we'll get your bed, dude. Uh, we should actually set you down. Jeez. There, you can walk around and, and test out the new house and see what you like. There's your bed, pal. Now, let's see what else. Oh, we have some chests here. Awesome. Let's go ahead and set those up and maybe get rid of some of this stuff in our inventories. Um, oh, let's hang up our chandelier actually right away. Nothing to make you feel at home more than a, a nice chandelier. Oh, it's not going to be in the center though. That's going to drive me mad. Oh, looks like we're just going to have to hang it kind of crappy, huh? There we go. Maybe we'll make another one and balance it out eventually, pal. All right. What else, What are you carrying? You have uh, a couple furnaces for us, um, which makes me want to really, really rearrange this room a little bit. Um. So I think I'm gonna do that over the next few days, pal. Um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna rearrange some stuff over here for for the next few days, and then and, and we'll also obviously keep our eye out for anybody that maybe wants to uh, move into this place or is already inhabiting this place. We'll, we'll just make sure that we're, we're easy to pack up if if anything goes wrong. <gasps> Chester, would you look at that? It seems to be a hidden chest. Hopefully it has some good treasures for us. Oh, that's really cool. We're still here on the first day, just moving stuff around. And oh, that's awesome. And and I don't know. I don't want to get stuck down there. So hold on. Let me... Wait. Oh, I just picked up all the crafting tables. Huh? Okay, here and here. I don't know. They have so many crafting tables in those. There's two here and they kept two upstairs as well. It's like they were crafting kings or something. Drives me insane. Like, why would you ever need that? Okay, let's go ahead and make some uh, slabs so it doesn't look like such a mess here. And then we'll, we'll go ahead and check out this chest now. Oh, sweet. Some iridium ore, copper. Awesome. This is all really good stuff. Let's go ahead and put it in our good good things chest then. I don't know what this is. That's really awesome too, though. We have quite a bit of food now as well, which is awesome. Okay, there we go. And now let's go ahead and break this chest and hopefully you pick them up for us, buddy. There's one, and then let's get this other one. Awesome. Now we'll just go ahead and pick up these things in the middle of the room. I don't know why they kept them here. It's like, it's kind of in the way, right? I mean, it it, it, it kind of takes up the whole room. Maybe it's just so that they can have torches. I don't know why I can't click you right now, buddy. Is it? No, it's not because I had a... Can I please reach you? No, that's so weird. Okay, well, we're gonna, I'm going to patch up the floor, buddy. I'll meet you outside here in a second. Okay, come on. Where are you, buddy? Hi. Okay, give me those two chests. Let's get back up into this house. 
Because nighttime is coming soon. Okay. That's pretty good. I think we're pretty much set up, buddy. Uh, maybe we should we should decorate a little bit, though. Like, why don't we go ahead and do this and this. So, look, now our bed looks nice. Not yours, though. You don't. You have a crap bed. And that's okay because you, you, you didn't walk here. I had to walk all the way over here. You didn't help at all, Chester. It drives me insane, man. You got to help out sometimes, you know? Okay, so let's go ahead and go to bed, buddy, and I will see you in the morning, I guess, uh, because I have our next project already aligned because obviously nobody has showed up today, but maybe somebody might show up tomorrow. I hope not, though. Let's go ahead and sleep. <sighs> that was the first good night of sleep we've had in a while, especially after that walk. I'm, I'm exhausted, man. Okay, let's go ahead and just get rid of some of this other kind of stuff that, yeah, we're not going to really want right now. And then where are you, buddy? Come come here. Where are you? Huh? What are you doing? You're chilling under the house? It's like he likes hanging out under there. Is it nice and cool under there, buddy? I don't know. We'll just call it your space for now. Okay, so I went ahead and gave you all of the uh, the Tinker's Construct things, the things that we're going to want to build tools out of from now on. Uh, let's go ahead and... First of all, organize a little bit more, and then we'll grab all this stuff and hopefully start getting build building. Uh, I do want to create ourselves a little structure out of cobblestone first, so that hopefully none of this can get destroyed by by some mean mean uh, mobs. Or I also don't want it to be detectable though. Oh, I have an idea. It, it'll be a dual purpose. That's a loud crow. It'll be a dual purpose underbelly uh, like uh, of the house. Watch. Check it out. So what we'll do is we'll also add a staircase down. I have a shovel here. We'll add a staircase down like this. And then I'll, I'll clean out some of this area. And it will, it will, it will first of all have a, have a, a furnace below us. And, and it will keep the house warm and the floor warm at night. Oh, it's such a good idea, buddy. So what we're going to want to do is clear out this area, and then we should be able to be ready to be building. All right, and there we go, buddy. Now let's go ahead and clear out part of this floor. Uh, what are we going to want? Actually, we might want to move it. That might not be the greatest spot for it. Get out of the hole, please. Come on, buddy. No, and now I placed down the wrong thing, of course. Jeez, you have me so distracted here. Let's go ahead and grab this. And there we go. Now, come on out. Come on. Come on. There you go, buddy. Okay, so what we're going to want to do is I think we're going to want to, like, recede it kind of here. So let's go ahead and build, dig out an area for our base of the structure. Just like this. And then we'll go ahead and lay down the floor work or the groundwork of it. Now we don't want to lose that. Let's go ahead and take out these ones here. Awesome. Now these ones can just be regular regular seared bricks because we don't really need to upgrade or we, we don't really need to be able to see through those because there's just dirt in the way, right? Uh, and then finally, I think we're going to we're gonna want another layer here, but just to be safe, buddy, we're not going to add that yet. Uh, let's go ahead and add our seared window now. We're going to want to see what's inside of it, right? Hmm, where do we put that? What, what side do we use that on? Well, it seems like there's more room on this side. So we're going to want to be able to see, I think, what's here like this, right? And then what we'll do is we'll put the actual controller down. First, we'll put this down, and then we'll put the controller down here, like this, and then that. Oh, wait, like that. So we have our tank on top, right? And then we should be able to do this, and this, and then this, and this, just like that. Now, this is really coming along here. Did I miss a piece? Did I not take a piece out of anybody? Ah, ah, no, come back. What, what are you doing over there? I know you're mad that we took your area down below already, but it, it, you have to deal with it. This is not a way to deal with it, Chester. Get over here. Now we're going to have to walk away. Look, we don't care. We got to play the ignore game. And there he is. See? Jeez, Chester, you're driving me crazy, buddy. And yeah, we did. We did miss the taps. Okay. So now let's go ahead and add our taps here. Uh, one, two. Wow, those crows, man. Two, three, okay, four. Okay, nice. And now let's go ahead and add, hmm. 
Hmm. I think we're going to want these two here and then the basins over here like this. Now, I say that because we're going to we're going to push this out one more here. And then we're going to place our crafting tables. Does that make sense? Does that make sense, Chester? I, I, I don't know if you're, you're even catching this. Are you even listening to me? Like, do I just babble to myself? Because that's how I feel right now, buddy. You're not helping at all. Okay, so first we want the stencil table, I believe. Yes, and then, oh, yeah, and then we want our pattern chest. And then we want our um, part builder, yes. And then our tool forge. Wait, where'd that go? Oh, yeah, tool forge. And then our crafting station. Now, the crafting station, because it's placed next to the tool forge, buddy, it can also be used to upgrade weapons. So you have you have, we'll have eight slots to upgrade your weapons as opposed to only having the two plus the weapon. So that's going to be really awesome that we have that right away. Oh, we, we have to finish off the top layer, it looks. Okay, I hope this is going to be enough. I don't know. The person that left it to us, I hope they knew what they were doing. Yes, okay, perfect. Awesome. Now let's go ahead and... One, two, three. Oh, just the perfect amount. That is amazing. And now let's go ahead and set down this um this lava. Where are we gonna put it? We need it like for safekeeping. I don't want it to ruin anything. Maybe we'll push out this one more here and here. Yeah, and then we'll go ahead and set this guy here just to be safe. And then we can just right click with a bucket and right click there if when we have buckets. Awesome. So now we have our Tinker's Construct Smeltery, man. Uh unfortunately. I think it might get too hot under our house. Let's hope it doesn't light fires. That would be really bad, buddy. Um, I think for my last thing, the last thing we do before we hit the hay man is I'm going to cut out all of this dirt and then I'm going to replace it with the cobble just so it's somewhere nice to walk so it doesn't so it doesn't fall apart on us. And I'm going to I'm going to build like the walls here out of dirt and stuff too. I think it'll end up looking really nice, okay, buddy? So let me let me go ahead and do that and then we'll we'll, we'll call it a night. Wow. Mm. Looks like I passed out working last night. Oh, well, I remember I was almost finished, too. Oh, no. Okay, so we have this cooking. Um, I need a little bit more stone, so let's go. I'm going to go grab somebody. Now, where can I find some? Hopefully, I can just dig right here and run into some stone fairly quickly. There we go. Okay, I think we only need a few more pieces. Okay, that should do it, pal. I hope that's going to be enough. I really did put a lot of work into this. I hope I hope it ends up looking okay. Let's go ahead and throw this in here. And then while we wait for those to cook, let's go ahead and do some work downstairs. Here we go. Yes, yes. This is, this is coming together really nicely, actually. I do like it a lot. Okay, here... Mm hmm. Nice. Oh no! See, we're so close, buddy. Let's go ahead and see if if any more of that is cooked already. Three more pieces. I don't know how many more we need. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, so we need how many more? Five more, buddy. Five more, and we're done. Oh, let me grab that torch for me, Bale. We should probably light up the downstairs here, just so. We don't have any issues with any mobs. There we go. And then maybe one like right here. I think that should be good. And then we'll probably have to place one in the middle as well. Let me, let's me let make some torches while we wait for that wood to cook then. Um, I have a little bit of wood in my inventory. Good. And there we go. And then there we go. Eight. And then let's just go ahead and grab eight pieces of coal there. Nice. Now we have our torches for everywhere so we don't... We don't run into any issues here. Now, I wanted to put two torches, like, maybe here and here as well, just so we're not getting caught by anything out here, hopefully. I don't know, man. You never know what happens. Oh, let's go ahead and eat this pizza. It's a little old, but I think I'll be okay with it. It does look delicious, though. Wow! That filled me up really quick. That's awesome. Let's go ahead and grab this last piece of pizza. Oh, wait, no, this last piece of stone. Oh, man, I'm getting so confused just talking to you, Chester. Nobody, Nobody's making conversation with me, and it's making me go a little crazy. And look at that, buddy. I think this looks 
absolutely awesome and it's a great use of the space i think uh it keeps us kind of low key where i mean i'm it is a tall house i'm not gonna lie but it keeps us a little bit more low-key like at least it's not out in the middle of nowhere and we can't get caught out hopefully by any bad bad mobs i mean this, this looks like it should be safe and i hope there's nothing that can scoot on under these these fences but you never know man you can and that's how we figured out this place so we'll have to keep an eye out man but i think we need to do some more exploring of this area soon but we'll have to save that for another day because i'm still pretty wiped from building this yesterday Let's just chill out. Maybe we'll make a little bit of food for us. We'll throw on a, a, a... Oh, we'll throw on one of our records and we'll listen to our records and we'll relax, man. Let's go ahead and do that and call it a day. And here we are. We don't have a record player, do we? Well, you know what? Maybe I'll just hum the music. Hmm, 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 hmm. Mm-hmm, 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 m